What's up, YouTube? And we're here with uh, Immortal Destinies, the Spanish version. Uh, something to note, I was opening one at the YCS, and some of the cards came in damage in the corner. Uh, that was pretty odd, but I'll be opening up this, and hopefully catch a live recording to see if cards do come out damaged in this product, so... Put on the seal, and... Let's get cracked. Yeah. Uh, dang. I have to make a mess out of this. Oh well. I don't want to be quick about this. You guys probably already seen these in English. But I'm bringing you a Spanish opening. This, because they're made from Europe, meaning um, the ratios are different from ours. Uh, supposedly for the Euro Heroes, they're really hard to pull. My last box had uh, the Fusion and the Dark Necrofear one. So, all right. So we start off with Espíritu de Estudio. So in this box, uh, ratio should not be a matter. Hopefully you get your five or six ultras and whatnot. And hopefully you can pull the short prints that are worth hot money right now. And the Bane worth like 65 and the Captain Gold worth like... Oh, see, speaking of that, $30 Necrofear. Necrofear de Malacion. And this one didn't come out damaged like the other one. The other one had a nick in the... Oh, actually, yeah. I don't know, you can see the tiny, tiny neck there. Yeah. It's okay, though. No, no, this one in the front. So that's one short print from the U.S. that we don't have in the European version. And, like, these ones are, like, one in every, like, what, seven boxes? Which warrants its $30 price, even though it's probably not playable at all. It's still hard to pull for the collector, so... Price will actually just go up. Because it's so hard to pull. <clears throat> so we got nothing here. And yeah, uh, nothing worth note for the commons. Because, um, except if you want, when you're looking for a Starring Venom Dragon again, it's been reprinted here as a rare. But you can get it um, super rare in uh, Hidden Fates. No, not Hidden Fates, sorry, in his Pokemon. What is that? Fist of the Gadgets? Yeah. You can get it there too. Oh, like that too, in Spanish. Dragon de Fusion. I can't pronounce the other two. Okay. Back to this box. Oh, another Espíritu de Malasia. So we got two of the Espíritu Oscuro. And that for the Fiend part two. We'll go along with this. Oh, nice. Spread Plasion. This is looking like exactly the same box I opened up the YCS. That one was like $13. I don't know the effect exactly, but the $13 probably might be good. Earthbound stuff. So here's hoping we pull Bane. If I do pull what I pulled last box, I am for sure going back and opening more boxes if they have it for sale. Okay, that's just insane. Why crack American boxes when you can crack European, in, I mean Spanish, German, French? You can just get these for like nothing, dude. It's amazing. Well, gimmick puppet. Yeah, this is looking exactly like my other box. What the? This is wild. If I pull exactly the same box, I'd be broke. <clears throat> and yeah, for you Spanish viewers out there. I can get Spanish product if you're looking for those cards. Just highly recommend just buying a box because I don't know how market is working for you guys here. If you guys get it for cheaper because it's so easier to pull, or if you guys still go buy TCG player, in which you know, just buying a box will get you there. Another Malasia. So four ultras, which we expect six to seven ultras and five to six supers. So almost there. Try not to be too reckless with these packs because I think the problem was me opening up you know, like a madman, and that's why the like, damage gets cornered. Nothing there. Yeah. Ooh, nice. And part of, oh, this one was a good reprint too. That was like 15 bucks for like a good three weeks. Usually if there's a hit, 
The rare would be second to last. So you can tell. One, two, three. See? So there's a hit. Is it a monster? Is it the cap and gold? Oh! oh <laughs> telling you, dude. Like these European, these, these boxes, dude, they don't care about ratios. You just pull stuff out of nowhere. This is going for. Um, 50. Yeah, 50. 50. 30 USD. 80 USD. 90 USD. Swap them out for English. Because there are people here that actually want Spanish copies of their own cards. And people that came out from the US, from the US looking for stuff like that. Yeah, so, you know. Works out. Win win. Oh, another hit. No way. You didn't get it. There's no way you got it. It's either the Fertifant Fusion or the Evil Hero. Oh, okay. okay, I was about to say, dude. <laughs> this is still good. It's like ten dollars right now, USD. So you got five supers and three ultras with two or three more ultras to go. Oh, if we pull all three of them, uh, you guys see it here first. I'm not lying when it comes to these ratios. <clears throat> got like about ten packs to go. All right. Sorry, man, it should be a good uh, dollar word to sell back at home. And this card, too, especially if they ever become good. Which I'm not doubting, they probably won't. They, they're pretty good. <clears throat> More gimmicks, puppets, and earthbound mortal stuff. Alright. It's a spell card. Oh, it's probably that ultra spell. Yep. Uh, we got the. Destiny Hero Searcher, this one uh, can dis discard um, any card to search out a level 8 beam or a Destiny board. So it's Destiny board support. Or if you want to search level golem, sure. It also works. Nothing there. So yeah, basically it's my exact same box, except this was the fusion. And the other ultra was the Earthbound Immortal, which hopefully I don't pull because that's only a dollar. For an ultra, we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight packs. Some more chances to pull the fiend, or maybe a double of that. We don't know. All right, here we go. Is it a fusion? It's a monster. Captain Gold. All right, Espirito. So we've doubled up. We got two militias and two of this trio. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six. That should be all of our ultras. I mean, all of our supers. I'm gonna take another one, which uh, that's fine. There's only one good super, and it was a pretty plot. Take there. <clears throat> More prodigies. Humpty Dumpty and pretty plant trap. Brace ourselves. Nah. It's a fusion. Nah. nah. Oh what? my <laughs> god, what the fuck? <laughs> Alright, you see it here, folks. I am not lying to you guys. Oops. That's fucking busted. He pulled every expensive card in one box. Necrofear, Captain Gold, and your one and only Malicious Bane. Are they lightly played, though? Yeah, actually. I think it's more for me opening the packs recklessly. Like this one, I for sure know I opened up recklessly. Cause these packs are so um, flimsy. flimsy. Like anytime you open and you just cut from the corner, cause I typically open the packs like this, then the corners didn't get chipped. So that's kind of on me, I guess then. It's not the packaging then. It's just my dumb ass opening packs like a dumb ass. <laughs> All right, four more packs with a chance for another ultra. Oh, imagine we pull another copy of that. Just play Evil Heroes now. Yeah, Spanish Evil Heroes, dude. <laughs> you, got two, you got two Banes. Two Banes. I'm gonna go back to them and be like, hey, gracias por los, los Banes. <laughs> Alright. Monster. Oh, that's a spell. Alright, that's another spell. It's a Death Battle Mortal spell. Two more packs. If I do get another hit, it will most likely be an Ultra. But I've maxed out on the Ultras already, so if I don't get anything in these two packs, then, yeah, should be it. <clears throat> Last pack. Can we do it? Can we pull the best box opening on YouTube? 
since I don't think I've seen Europeans opening their boxes. All right. Humpty Dumpty. I forgot what that's called. I forgot that what it's called in English. And yeah, we didn't get anything. So my other box got six ultras. And this got five ultras, but you know what? 65 USD, 50 USD, 30 USD, 10 USD, and 5 USD. And, and the Predator Plant Fusion to top it off, which is 10 USD. I'll safely to say I doubled my money on this box. And my other box paid for itself too. And yeah, that is the opening of Spanish, aka European version of Immortal Destiny. So if you're on the hunt for these cards, go on eBay or whatnot, see if you can try to get these boxes for cheap. Thanks.